After a long meeting and voting, the Israeli government finally announced a temporary ceasefire agreement with Hamas on early Wednesday morning at around 3 a.m. According to the agreement, Israel and Hamas will cease fire in the Gaza Strip for four days. Hamas will release 50 Israeli women and children hostage. In addition, Israeli media reported that Israel will, will release 100, about 150 Palestinian prisoners held in Israeli prisons. Although the Israeli government's far-right parties clearly oppose the agreements, it still ultimately passed the cabinet's collective vote. In addition, in a speech before the cabinet meeting. Netanyahu made it clear that the temporary ceasefire does not mean the end of the conflict. He said Israel will resume fighting after the ceasefire ends until its set objectives achieved.